Hello, lovely people, and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West. Thank you guys for joining me today, and I hope you enjoy this one. Okay, so in our last episode, we got our rite of passage. So now we're here in the Forbidden West. So let's see what it has to offer. Alright, so let's jump here in the water and call our horse. There he is, there he is. Let's jump on his back and let's head off. Alright. Okay, so it looks like we have a camp here, so let's check that out. Something's going on with that camp. You really think you can do that? Karoof, come on! You know me. Have I ever given you anything less than perfection? So these are the guys that came out to scavenge after we got ambushed by... Regella. If it isn't the savior of Meridian, and of my very own operation. Larand, say hello. Hello, nice to meet you. You know, if it weren't for this one, I probably wouldn't be standing here right now. I was at Baron Light when the Tanakh attacked. Nasty business. But every codger in Osaram is thankful you drove him off. So what are you doing out here? Well, to hammer it plain, there's treasure in the West. Unclaimed scrap and ancient metal. And I've got a sturdy band of salvagers that's ready to take advantage. We'll buy any scrap you got. And if you're looking for machine parts, we've got the best in the West. Guaranteed. And soon we'll be trading in more than just that. For too long, the West has been, well, forbidden. Dangerous. But, what if I told you we could make an armor so tough, so infallible, that you'd never have to worry about survival out here again? I'd be curious to take a look at it. Of course you would! <laughs> and that's why I've asked my most talented salvagers to find what they need to make that armor. Each of them will present their work to me. The best protection will go on sale to hunters, just like you. Lucky me. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have some business to attend to back in Chainscrape. Larand can take care of you while I'm gone. Can't wait to see what you come up with, my boy. Leave it to me. It'll blow all the others out of the forge. You have got to help me. What are you talking about? The armor. I made a dozen versions of it. But none of them were good enough. And there are other crews further west. If they make better armor than mine, I can kiss that keg full of shards goodbye. So you get a prize if Karif picks your armor? A big one. And I finally have the perfect design. I just need the right parts, and fast. So maybe you'd be willing to pick up a contract and get them for me? What would I be looking for? Shellwalker containers. Their plating's made to withstand a lot of damage. It'll make the perfect armor. I know it. I think I can handle that. Ah, oh, thank the forge. All right. We scouted out a herd near here. Here's the contract. It'll tell you everything you need to know. You take the machines down. My people will pick up the containers. I'll give this a closer look later. Thanks. I'm counting on you, Aloy. Okay, okay. But, uh, like I said, we can uh, check that out later. Because we're trying to get the main quest going, you know? Before going on the hunt. Alright. Convoy ambush. Open quest menu. There we go. Level 8. This looks like it might be an important quest. Maybe we can uh, get some sort of armor. Or even uh, some weapon. Let's just keep going. Now what's going on here? Alright, uh, let's take this guy out. Alright, wrong guy. <laughs> Alright, looks a little bit stuck here. Let's just take this dude over there. Mm -hmm. Where are you going? Alright, let's knock this guy out. What's going on here? 
Come on now, can you get over this little bush? Alright, let's, let's take our arrow. Get rid of him. Get out of here. Oh my god. These bushes, man. Fighting me like I'm stuck. <laughs> Come on now. Let's uh, see what she got to say. Okay, calm down. If it isn't the hero of the day, sure I'm glad you came by when you did. Are you all Delvers? We've been working No Man's Land for a while. I was hoping to get back to Baron Light by the time they opened the gates, you know, after that embassy of theirs. Seeing as how we almost got Miz to pieces just now, I'm guessing things didn't go so well. You could say that. It's not like No Man's Land was safe to begin with. But I didn't think I'd have to worry about the Sanak, the neutral territory. And now, they're riding machines! If you were headed back to Baron Light, why did you stop here? We ran across some ruins nearby. Thought we'd take a gander, find some good salvage. But the place is full of weird red crystals. Can't get through the stuff. So we ended up making camp here. First thing tomorrow, though, we head straight to Baron Light. Should probably send a message to our crew down at Jagged Deep about all this, too. Jagged Deep? It's a dig site by this big lake down south. Old world scrap everywhere. Can't miss it. <laughs> and that's my cue. Here. Thanks for helping us out. Maybe I'll get into more trouble and see you around. Well, let's hope not. <laughs> yeah, let's hope not. Smoke bombs. Alright, cool. That sounds like it's going to be interesting. So we're going to use that to confuse our enemies. Alright, that will be sick once we get the option or chance to use it. Okay, so Karja Camp. Looks like there's some side quests here as well. Have to keep a mental note on all these places so we can go back. Look at all these creatures. Okay, all right. Thunder jaw. All right, get out of here. Let's go. <laughs> He's coming. Man, look at this, huh? Okay. It looks like the coordinate silence gave me match that wreckage. Did he install Hades on another Titan? Of course, he probably did. But look how beautiful this looks. Alright, let's see if we can get this dude from all the way up here. Mm-hmm. You didn't see me, did you? Alright, let's see if we can knock him out a bit. Okay. He's aggroed now. You can see us. What are you gonna do, huh? You can chuck your rock up here, huh? Okay, you need to calm down a little bit. How'd you get that rock? There's only water down there, bro. Look at his HP, and I can't even get him. There's no range. Right, next, idea. next idea, what are you talking about? Just craft some more arrows. We've got plenty of materials. Alright, let's get a little bit closer. can hear something here. Sounded like uh, another one. Where'd you go? Alright, let's keep going. Alright, let's take this dude out. Come here, bruh. Missed? <laughs> Alright, there we go. Oh, there you are. Where were you hiding, eh? Come here. Oh, no. Ay, ay, ay. He can attack me when he's in the water and I cannot attack him let's take this dude out yeah we're gonna do eh? nothing all right look at all these things here so many to collect oh, the blue thing get that stealth kelp will hide you from underwater enemies 
enchant compartment. Let's pry this open. See what's in there. <laughs> this game is so sick. There's so much stuff you can do. I can spend my whole day down here. But I'll probably drown, but you know what I mean. Alright, we need to investigate a little bit. Uh, I should probably leave this alone for now. Why? 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 This is it. The location of the coordinates I scanned from the spire. A workshop underneath a dead Horus Titan. Just the kind of place silence would slink away to. But what was he doing here? Yeah, what was he doing, huh? Let's scan that. Oh, listen to audio. Poor Hades. So cramped in there. No room to think. He can't even speak. Now the processing orb of a Titan, on the other hand, well, you're used to that. But once I learned you on that, you'd be so much more comfortable until interrogations begin anyway. All right, let's activate this. Aloy, consider this message a beacon to help guide you out of the fog of ignorance. Using explosives, I've detached the processing orb from the Titan overhead. A perfect cage for our mutual friend, Hades, in order to render it cooperative. Tell her what we've discussed about the mysterious signal that gave you life. <laughs> thinks he's got it all figured out. Bastard. And I guess there's only one way to find out where he moved the orb. Okay, so we need to follow the, this uh, path of the orb. So let's get on the horse, because I don't know how long we have to travel to get to the objective. So here I am, following along after silence like a fool. After he tricked me by rigging his lance to steal Hades. Crazy AI that wants to kill everything. You can't just let me do the same thing and destroy it. And now I'm gonna have to put up a more of a self-righteous bull. Yeah, man, but uh, you're the one that trusted him at the beginning, so he was a little bit shady. Silence must be pretty confident he's found a backup of Gaia, but how? Every place I've checked, every lead, they've all been dead ends. All backups purged. So what did Hades tell us? Huh. Probably lies as well, so. You're probably gonna betray us again. The merchant. Didn't expect to see anyone else out here. Oh there! What's Honora doing this far west? Ah, uh, no matter, no matter. I can get you stocked up for the wild. Okay, can you? Let's uh, find out what he got. Let's see here. Frost Hunter Bow. Forge Fire Tripcaster. Slicing Shredder Gauntlet. Nora Sentinel. Armor. Okay, not bad. Looks like the trail goes under the hillside. Alright, let's search the crate. Oh wow, okay, jackpot. Look how much stuff we got. Nice. Let's get that as well. And let's head off inside. Ruin. Okay. Let's see where this goes. So the sirens use that machine to haul his prize. Yup. It's annoying to think that we have to go with what silence is saying because obviously we don't have much of a choice. That must be the orb silence stuck Hades in. From that door. It looks like a pharaoh facility. Or a zero dawn. 
Come on, Hades. You still in there? Nah, it can't be that easy, can it? Oh wow, okay. Guess we're gonna have a little conversation with AI. Gaia backup? Silence asked you where to find a backup of Gaia. Data error. Memory structures disintegrated. Right. Because that would have been easy. Yeah, of course. It would have been too easy, Aloy. Alright, Hades. So what did Silence do what to did you? Silence do to you, Hades. It's like you've been hollowed out. Silence interrogated me. And what did you tell him? Data error. Memory structures disintegrate. You don't remember any of it? I remember you. What, like me beating you at the spire? <laughs> Okay, that's not going anywhere. <laughs> hey, hello, I got away with words, doesn't she? Alright, okay, where is Silence now then? Do you know where Silence went? No, he departed 12.8 days ago. Perhaps he Data error. Behavior prediction structures disintegrated. So you don't know anything more than I do? Useless Hades, huh? Okay, so why did he leave you here then? Do you know why Silence dragged you to these ruins? Silence intended you find me here. Obviously. But why? What was this place? Location is square. Data error. Memory structures disintegrate. My deathbed, he called it my grave. But you... I guess I'll find out when I go inside. Yeah, it's starting to get a little bit frustrating now, isn't it? So, come on now, give us something. So, let's ask about the other subordinate functions. When the mysterious signal transformed you, it made Gaia's other subordinate functions conscious too. You escaped when Gaia destroyed herself, but so did they. Where did they go? Each function migrated to coordinates based on data error. Memory structures disintegrated. Bunch of crazed AIs scattered who knows where, doing who knows what. Hephaestus kills thousands every year with the combat machines it keeps making. Seven more functions out there cooking up trouble. It's not a happy thought. You are unhappy. Good. Anyone ever tell you you've got a great personality, Hades? Sarcasm detected. Yeah, didn't think so. <laughs> well, good job, Hades. Alright, let's talk about the mystery signals. Silence questioned you about the mysterious signal. The one that woke you, gave you consciousness. 
Who sent it? Signal transmitted by masters. And who are they? Masters who create to destroy earthly life. Who would want that? <laughs> But like, I wonder if it's silence that uh, erased his data. So you're the one who's doomed, not me. Enough. It's time to finish this. Does Aloy still think she can restore Gaia, save life on Earth? Yeah, Aloy does. What would you know, Hades? Twice you tried to destroy life on Earth, and twice you failed. The only extinction you ever brought about is your own. And there's no tricked out lands to save you this time. You are incorrect. Three times, Hades extinguished life. What? You remember this? Yes. So? That, that's centuries ago. It's what you were designed to do. There won't need to be. I'm saving this one. Master Override arms. Connected it. State name and rank. Elizabeth Sobek, Alpha Prime. Master override activated. Bridging extinction protocol. Maybe you can stay dead this time? It will. You can trust. Trust? Me. Yes. Trust. As in, since I did what you could never do, and extracted all of Hades' priceless knowledge, you can trust that I was willing to actually let you destroy it this time. So back to holograms instead of face to face? What, afraid I'd stab you or something? There's a reason and I... And using the same spyware, I see, so... All those times I called, you could have just answered. But I guess you just prefer to go on spying all this time. My world stopped revolving around you months ago, Aloy. I've had work to do. Countless hours of research. As demanding and time intensive as it has been critical to the fate of this planet. <laughs> right. Of course. You're just trying to save the world, too. That's right. The difference, of course, is that unlike you, I've produced the results. Did you find a backup of Gaia or not? Oh, yes. I believe I did. Where? Voila. Why do you think I summoned you here? Behind that gene-locked hatch lie the ruins of the ancient facility where the Hades Extinction Protocol was perfected. A testing process that ran hundreds of trials, each of them using a backup of Gaia. Hades told you this? It took some convincing, but yes. So, are you ready to go get what you've been searching for for the last six months? Or are you just going to stand there with your mouth open? How dare you, bro? You got some explanation to do. So let's ask about the machine riders. Exceptionally busy. But not so busy you couldn't teach Tanakh the rebels to override machines, ride them as mounts. Aloy, hey, 
The only issue you should be concerned about is obtaining a guy backup. Perhaps if you focused more, you might actually see results. That's not exactly a denial, Silence. Take it any way you want. Yeah, I know, I know, I will, I will. But let's see, do you know if there's any Gaia's backup Just in there? Just to confirm, Hades said that there are backups of Gaia in there. Yes, or were anyway, a thousand years ago. Backups that didn't get purged when Ted Farrow wiped every copy of Apollo. Correct. According to Hades, this facility could not be accessed by remote signal. Not even Ted Farrow could touch the data here. Backups. Data complete. Gaia and her subordinate functions. Everything needed to reboot the system. Restore control over the terraforming system. Save life on Earth. In there. So Hades said. So what are you waiting for? Yeah, I don't trust you, guy. I don't trust you at all. But what do you know about the mystery signal, eh? Hades didn't know nothing. Did Hades reveal the source of the mysterious signal? The one that woke it, tried to destroy life on Earth? Yes, it did. Care to share? In due time. First things first, Aloy. Last I checked, you still had a super intelligent AI named Gaia to reboot. Yeah. The same Gaia who had to destroy herself 20 years ago because of the signal? It stopped being transmitted years ago. It's no longer a threat. What if it repeats? It won't. Even if it did, well... Look, the details are complicated, but the signal required Hades to take effect. Delete Hades from any backup you reboot, and Gaia is safe. Now stop wasting time. Go get a backup. So why didn't you do it, huh? Why didn't you open the door? I'm gonna be confused there. All right, so ready to go. Let's go. All right, I'll search the facility for a Gaia backup. But just to be clear, Silence, if this ends up being another one of your tricks, it's a gene locked hatch, Eloy. You're literally the only person who can open it. How could I set a trap inside? Trick me again, Silence, and our next conversation will be face to face. Though you won't have much to say. On account of my spear being buried in your throat. Aloy, thanks to me, everything you've desired, everything you've been fumbling about, unable to achieve for six months, is now within your grasp. Now, I know you didn't learn much about manners growing up a Nora outcast, but in a situation like this, you say thank you, and I say you're welcome. cocky guy isn't he so now we understand why he was not able to open this door because he needed me to do it since it's activated by my genes since I'm the clone of Dr. Elizabeth Solbeck but yeah he got a point he couldn't have put a trap in there so we're still not trusting him though but we will see silence we'll see when we meet okay okay so let's open the door messed up obviously but despite the malfunction you can still get through if you'll be patient for a while longer see those crystals there the asram call them fire gleam they're combustible not nearly powerful enough to blast through a door like that but maybe just enough to jolt it open a bit more exactly it will only work with an igniter I'm sending you the schematics now. To build it, you'll need some machine parts and the oil from a kindle weed plant. That only grows underwater, but you should be able to find some of the nearby lake. The parts are more complicated. You'll need a spark coil from within a leap lasher's power cell. Remove the power cell before you kill the machine, or else it'll break. Got it. Well, I already have some deep water kindle weed. Just need to get the parts. 
All right, so we got one of the material. So we just need to go outside and get the other bits, which is the power cell, I believe. But yeah, this is still being suspicious. I'm a bit suspicious, you know. But there's a few red flags because Hades told him about the mystery signals. But when we ask, Hades got an error. So I would want us to fight this guy because uh, I really like him very much. <laughs> but anyway, guys, that is it for me. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give it a like. Consider subscribing and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.